Hey everybody, welcome back to Kitty Speaks. It's Kitty. I am here today with another edition, and I am sorry that this edition is from right in bed with my head on the pillow, but um I'm sick. But I wanted to just do a short video uh to let you guys know that I'm <laughs> I'm still I'm still here. Um I, I, I love you guys and I miss you guys and so I'm just going to do a short video about this month's boxes. Uh, I'm going to talk about the winners and the losers of this month's boxes. I subscribe to Ipsy and Birch and uh, Onyx Box which is um, a box that is aimed primarily at African American women. So if you haven't heard about it, you should check it out. Now, Ipsy and Birch are both $10 each for the subscription per month. The um, Onyx box is $25 a month, but it is five full-size products. Or normally it's five full-size products because this month I got four full-size and a sample, but um, a deluxe sample. But first I want to talk about the winner. The winner for the November box subscriptions, for my November box subscriptions, was Birch Box because I love this. This is my favorite item that I have gotten out of all 15 products. It is a Laura Mercier. I have to read the bottom every time. Full blown volume lash building mascara. <laughs> Sorry. And also, um, my face, I know it looks crazy, but uh, I am um, test running. I looks for tomorrow. I have two doctor's appointments in the morning, and so that is why um, I'm looking all crazy about the eye. I look like I got a black eye, and it's not even all the way done, but that's that's what I was doing. Let me see if I can show you. Some crazy looks for you right there. Uh, what is going on? Anyway... So the winner is Birchbox because Birchbox sent this. This mascara is $25 and it's the bomb. I, I absolutely love it. So the loser of this month's box subscriptions is Onyx Box. And although I love Onyx Box and I really do recommend it to African American women, it is great. If you can, um, you know, not everybody doesn't want to put a $25 monthly subscription in their in their budget but it, it it really is great I've been introduced to some really great things but this month they flat out lose and here's the reason why I have lupus and because of my lupus I have a really severe problem with hair shedding and like just I could just pull my hair out in the shower in in big old clumps sometimes because of that, I relax my hair. I would prefer for my hair to be natural, but my hair is very curly naturally. And what happens is when I go to comb my hair and go to detangle it, that causes even more breakage. I have discovered that when my hair is straight and doesn't and has less of a chance to get tangled, I retain more of my hair in my head. And so I discovered that by trial and error, and that is the reason why I personally relax my hair as opposed to going natural. Um, I was natural for many years, and I love it. I love being able to just wash my hair and go. That was awesome. But because of the um, disorder that I have, for me personally, my hair needs to be relaxed. I take extra special care of my hair because I have to, on the one hand, weigh all the chemicals in my hair um, against, you know, detangling. And when I do that, I'm able to keep my hair healthier and more of it in my head when it's relaxed. Now, they make you fill out a very precise personal questionnaire. Most of the boxes do. They want to determine what your likes are and dislikes so that they make sure that you're mostly happy every month. And they can introduce you to new products that you have a better chance of, of liking and you know being well received by you I put that my hair is relaxed in my profile this month I received a bunch of products for natural hair 
in other words hair that is not relaxed now I don't know what's up with that but now I have to find somebody to give these products to I can't use them and I am uh, unhappy I, I am unhappy like I literally I had two products in my box that I could use one was this cargo lip gloss which is a really pretty shade and I haven't used it yet but it's cargo and I am familiar with cargo and they have awesome products this is the lip gloss and so I th this I am happy with um, there was this pear berry dry sweet oil that has an amazing smell that smell like I've never smelled something that smells like this before it's very unique and it smells very good but I don't know what I'm supposed to do with it am I supposed to use it like essential oils and just put it on my post points is it supposed to be like an incense oil or I don't know what the purpose of it is but I like I do like the way that it smells so but let me show you the other three products in my box um my earphones. Miss Jessie's Coily Custard. So this is for um, it's a wash and go styler that really works for TWAs and kinky coily hair. I don't know what a TWA is, but I don't have kinky coily hair, and so yeah, okay. Um, motions. A big old tube of Motions Deep Conditioning Mask for Natural Textures. And this this is something that uh, I probably would have liked, but I just bought some body butter. It's Cantu Shea Butter, coconut, Cocoa Butter, and Vitamin E. No sulfates, no mineral oil, softening body butter. And that really wasn't a miss, but... Two out of five products is fully 40% of my box of products that I cannot use, that are that are not for me. And so, um, that was like an epic fail in my book. You know, two of the products I can't use. The other, the third product I don't want to use. Um, and so that's 60% of my box I am unhappy with. And... To be fair, only 40% of it is their fault. <laughs> but, like, I don't even know. But, um, yeah. I don't have anything else to say. That is all I have for this edition. So, in any event, until next time, love, peace, and hair grease. Ciao.